In order to get Liberty Prime fully operational, we're going to need your help. <laughs> Waste of no time. Problem. I'm sure this only looks worse than it actually is. <laughs> I wish I had your confidence, because this is not going to be easy. <laughs> we're missing now, all the, the parts. Is that we've got most of Prime's parts fully assembled. The bad news is that it's going to take more than a few rivets and some spot welding to get them working again. And the first problem is his CPU. It's fragile, and every time we try to feed power to it, it blows itself out. <laughs> you can fix it. There's got to be a way to solve that. I do all the maintenance on the Cridwing, so you'd think it'd be a snap. As much as I hate to admit it, Prime's power systems are out of my league. Luckily, you were able to convince Dr. Madison Lee to return to the Brotherhood. She was on the original build team for Liberty Prime a little over a decade ago. I've already spoken to her, but she's reluctant to work on Prime for some reason. If you could get her down here to lend a hand with his power system, we can get the big guy moving. Skeletor at the bar. <laughs> very exciting. <laughs> so, you know. It wasn't not a picture of I'm just kidding. These people really need to learn how to use their visors. Alright, also I was not paying attention at all to what I should have been paying attention to. Oh, uh, Dr. Lee, okay. That's what pit boys are for. I really I really think I'm gonna just wear my power armor into the institute if I have to go back there. I don't see why you wouldn't be able to. I'd just fast travel. Heard you gave those muties at Fort Strong something to think about. Yeah, do you? I don't know you. Aren't they like interrogating her? I'm just gonna run it. Hey, about this secret project that you've already started working on. They're all beating her up. Uh, it's good to be back. I don't feel brotherhood. Um, Inter interrogation tactics would be very nice. I prefer laser weapons myself. They strike me as the weird tortury type. Where is the technology? That's all they do. And yet they're really bad at finding it. In uh, New Vegas, they have a bunker, pretty much. Like, that's just underground. Pretty much, like, it's what okay. the Institute has. But on a much more Bravo brotherhood six, scale. Like, it's essentially this shit just underground. Um, and it's not even, like, deep. It's just, I, if I remember correctly. I must commend you. Convincing Dr. Lee to return to the brotherhood, I didn't think it was possible. Now, are you in need of treatment? <laughs> No. Use some supplies, actually. Scribe. Um, let's see. Definitely need some addictol. <laughs> That's required. Oh no. That's why I don't open the first one because then it just nonstop. But like, is she just like staring at her phone? Like, did Eric open it? <laughs> no, I just. I'm, I never pay attention to uh, Snapchat or whatever. Anytime you send anything, I'm like, oh yeah, I forgot. I was supposed to look at this. Never hey, expected Dr. Lee would return to the brother. Are there documents you wanted to turn in? Uh -huh. Oh yeah, you. I found some technical documents for you. Splendid. Here are the caps that I promised. Remember, it's like really not worth it, dude. You give me so little for these. Is that a cat? Oh, it's still so weird. This doesn't look right. This is a scary cat. <laughs> I don't like it. <laughs> All right. Liberating the Commonwealth is a huge responsibility. But we'll get this job done. Charging into a situation with guns blazing is a good way to get yourself killed. No, it's not. That's the best way to go about everything. <laughs> this is just run in. No, I guess I don't have that other stuff. My spanner 
like to move. If you're here to talk me into working on Liberty Prime, you can forget it. <laughs> but Dance liked that. <laughs> what changed your mind? Nothing changed my mind. I promised you I'd return to the Brotherhood, and I've kept. Mm. Do I need to remind you why? Of course not. <laughs> Darn it, Lee. not but you no, I don't neglected care. dimension that I'd be asked to work on Liberty Prime I've been down this road with a brother I Why didn't I know mistake twice literally Lee, this is like my third day because <laughs> because we care what happened and we want to stop the Institute <laughs> I guess Dan's <laughs> liked that answer you to fucking weapon. jump in you know, if anyone else oh it's it, it, it's verified he did he enjoyed like that, that very much I'd laugh in their face but coming from you <laughs> you naive fool. <laughs> Tell Proctor Ingram to get her scribes ready. It's going to take a hell of a lot of work to get Liberty Prime back. That's online. all it took was like so motivational it. speech about the Commonwealth being a place for good. What do you think about Scribe Halen? What? Um, She's as dedicated as they come. I don't know who he's talking about. <laughs> She's a great person. Evaluation of her performance as a scribe. like you to ask me something like that no it's not the truth is i'm worried about her since you and <laughs> Can't i are take him seriously life, felt like <laughs> i could confide in you about it to get your honest opinion i appreciate that you value my opinion so highly tell me what's on your mind <laughs> let me explain everything from the beginning a few months <laughs> Damn, <laughs> there are lots of people around <laughs> I'm confiding in you. Halen stayed by that night's side for two days straight, without sleep, fighting to keep him alive. But he was on a slow decline. I decided that his suffering needed to end and ordered Halen to administer an overdose of painkillers so he could die with dignity, even though I'm certain she wanted to continue fighting for that night's life. She injected him. Sounds like she was simply following your orders. Of course she was. Halen's never been the subordinate. But the I decision whether that. or not to ease that soldier's suffering isn't the point here. The point is what happened later that same evening. <laughs> Halen approached me while I was on watch. She didn't say a word, but I could tell something was wrong. After what felt like an eternity, she collapsed into my arms crying. <laughs> I'm telling you this because now we're gay. Do, so I we love each other deeply. Mind. A few minutes later, she stopped. Just I'll get she you, Dance. I don't even know what his perk is. I don't even know if he has one. <laughs> his perk is that it's terrible. It's all bad. Maybe I pushed her too hard. I ordered her to ignore her instinct. There's a thing in New Vegas uh, where you go into like a, a some terribly like unequipped and understaffed uh, like medical tent area. And you have to perform like these surgeries, and you can really fuck them up. Like there's like just a lit. Like I think one person like loses all their limbs because you have to like um, you have to operate or like cut someone's leg off. It was like a gangrene thing, I think. Are you ignoring me for a reason? Oh my god, Dads, chill out. I'm talking about another game. See what you're getting at. I guess I never thought of it that way. Look, um. But yeah, if your medical skill isn't high enough, or if you don't have the right things, you do it and it just fucking, it just butchers them. <laughs> or like, it's like, oh, he did this, and then he convulsed and died. <laughs> You're like, oh, man. How can I have confidence in myself? The way you've held Halen tells me you care about them. And they care about you. I, I never thought of it that way. Well, it seems like you need to do a lot of thinking, dance. I signed up to be your sponsor, so I teach you everything that I know. But it looks like I'm the one that needed the lesson today. 
All joking aside, I'm pleased that we had this discussion. And with all the problems you're facing, you still took the time to listen. It's comforting to know that I can speak to you as more than just your commanding officer. Uh oh, here goes. Be honest next time. Hardly think. <laughs> oh, nothing would be more appropriate. I'll get him. <laughs> I don't think I ever talked with Piper. Oh yeah, I did, because she was at that point. I, I, uh, I don't know. I, I told you I'd get him. You'd ask me something like that. It would depend on the circumstances, but I suppose we'll just have to see what happens when the time comes. Well. Anyway, thanks for letting me get that off. <laughs> I can't even say anything. <laughs> it's been way more than I realized. Get myself I'm in trouble. Instead of at my best. You know, with my one viewer and all. All. R. Once we decrypt uh. that intel you recovered from the Institute. Oh, beer. A lot more about them. Dude. 